everybody, and welcome to Letters Page, the show where we open up packages, postcards, letters, all kinds of things that you guys send us to our P.O. Box. Hey, and if you want to do the same thing, just check the description box down below or send it to P.O. Box 1157, Denver, New Jersey, 07834. Now let's get to the packages! Woo! Boom. All right. Wow, we did it. Yeah. We got to them. We're here. All right, so long. Thanks for joining us on Letters Page. That was really fun, right? Yeah. Where is the knife? I don't know. That's an excellent question. Crap. Anyway, this is from Glenn. All right, crack And that it. rhymes with Ben, so then I'm going to open it. <laughs> That's as good a reason as any. I have to open it more. We don't know if it's actually from Glenn, because it does say eBay. Yeah. So it could have been ordered from Glenn. Right? Ooh, that's a possibility. If you're like an eBay seller, do you get this special tape? Like, what's the deal with this tape? Can I buy this tape? Anyway, Glenn's from Louisville, Kentucky, and he sent us... Ooh. Batman Planetary Deluxe Edition. Ooh. Very well sealed, by the way. Yes. Ben's gonna rip the dust jacket I know it's <laughs> Well, if it's an older DC comic... Ow. Oh, it's not. Ow. Oh. There. <laughs> nice. That looks like uh, John Cassidy. Oh, yep. Wow. Oh, it's a crossover. It's Batman and Planetary from Warren Ellis and John Cassidy. Oh, that makes more sense now. Interesting. Yep, that's exactly what this is. It wouldn't make sense, though, if it was planetary, because, like, normally he's just in Gotham. Right, yeah, like, every episode of Batman is planetary. Thank you very much, Glenn? We hope. Or whoever ordered it from yeah. Glenn. This one's from Artie. Yay. In Washington, D.C. Ooh. You know, I used to live uh, not far from D.C., and I've driven there on multiple occasions city is a nightmare. <laughs> I went there on a school trip one time. Me too. When visiting sunny California, be sure to, be sure to visit... Oh. oh. It's a long par five in the nation's capital. This is very well sealed. Indeed. Thank oh, God it's not the styrofoam it. thingy. No. Where, like, it's the stuff that comes out. Uh-huh. I'm going to cut the bag here. She cut the bag! This was a good uh, surgical procedure there. You really knew where to cut. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do spend a lot of time trimming paper down. Mm. So. Plus, she stabbed Batman in the leg. She did, because she's. <laughs> it's not what I meant to say by that. <laughs> <laughs> you were on that episode, though. Hi, y'all. Hey. Happy belated Halloween. Yes, Thank very you. belated. Very much so now. Our fault. Um, asking you shall receive, Ben. You wanted a Marvel monster story? Here you go, Artie. No, it's for you. He said, here you go, Ben, but like that doesn't mean it's for me. It means it's for all of us. Yeah. Plus, I imagine you have some information on this. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, there's a Halloween mask inside. It's the Supernaturals! I've never heard of this. It's a, clearly, <laughs> it's a team-up of many of Marvel's uh, lesser-known and not less, not quite so lesser-known uh, supernatural characters, including Ghost Rider. Yeah, what? I see Ghost Rider. Where I recognize the... Ghost Rider. Yep, it's... Bro oh, oh, wow, it's the original... Well, not original. It's Brother Voodoo, the Black Cat, Ghost Rider, Satana, or Satana, depending on how you want to say it, Gargoyle, and Werewolf by Night. Nice. But that's not Selena Kyle, or... Uh, what the fuck? No, but it is. But that's not Felicia Hardy, Black Cat, is it? It is. Oh, it is. That's weird. No, nope, it's her. She's like dark haired this time. Yeah. There she what? is. And this is Johnny Blaze. Or, J I'm sorry, John Blaze. Oh, excuse me. When he grew I'm sorry. Up. Johnny is my son. Yes. With an immature name. I am John Blaze. And here is our mask. Oh. Is that Brother Voodoo? It is Brother Voodoo. That's incredible. That's okay. Really weird. I like on this, on this second issue, they didn't think that you quite got who was in the book, so they listed who was in the book at the top. <laughs> Just in case you were like, I'm not buying You mean this for book. me? <laughs> yeah. But on issue two, hey, and it's Grey Gargoyle, or Gargoyle, not Grey Gargoyle. Mm. Who looks a lot like uh, Etrigan? Yes. Yeah. Like all Gargoyles look I like. I have to know who the other ones are. Wow. Oh, it's Werewolf by Night? Nice. How are you supposed to get these out of here? And it's Ghost Rider. And Ghost Rider. Hell yeah, that's the best one. Well, that's why it's in issue four. You gotta get to the end. Yeah. So. We should have a back issue. Yeah, you're going to do this yeah. next Halloween, Supernatural? Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. I will it won't be scary. It doesn't I'll matter. Who cares? Scary you don't have to be scary. Yeah. Or you could not. Yeah. We could just scary. do a nice story for right? Halloween. Right? We could just have a nice spooky fucking fun time. No. Mm. Not on my watch. Thanks, Artie. Thanks, Artie. How will I give you nightmares? 
This is from Ed, and it says, please open on the show. Well, Ed, let's do it. We have two books, uh, Invasion from Planet Wrestletopia. <laughs> Check them out. From Michael. In? Aurora Valley. Arizona. As. Oh, my God. No, he's an ass. You're an ass. <laughs> Antenna, you can keep the box. Yeah, but it's a Madden box. You love these things, right? Yeah, you like Steve every, Madden shoes. Every magazine I've ever had has told me that girls love Steve Madden. This is true. I, I, ha that. I have a really oh. nice, strappy pair of red heels that are Steve Madden. Oh, how are they? I love them. Oh. Still stands. <laughs> and there's a note. You just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. And I I'm going to read it now. Oh. <laughs> what are you going to say? I wonder who it's, it's from. That's it's... the rest of the thing. Oh, is that Blue's Clues? It's yes. Blue's Clues. Hey. Well, it's from Mike. We know it's from Mike. I like that. Man, In Aurora like, Valley. For a minute, Ben was like, wow, Tootie came up with a whole song about letters. I'm like, yes. Yeah. Yes, it was me. I did that. That's a good song. I'm going to go back in time and sue some people. <gasps> uh, <laughs> greetings, Comic Pop Crew. Hi. I hope this letter finds you all well. It finds three of us well. We yes. can't find Ethan. No, he's missing. It's a mystery. Hashtag where's Ethan? Uh, this is the first time I've ever sent a letter into a show that I've watched on YouTube. Uh, with that said, your mailbox, your mail unboxings are so entertaining that I finally felt driven to write in. Nice. Thank you. Uh, interestingly enough, I didn't really start watching your content until fairly recently, but I've known of you guys for years thanks to my being a fan of the Weekly Pull and Comics Explained. There you go. Well, thank you, Robin Benny. Yeah. Recently, I've had a lot of time on my hands because I've been quite ill. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh. And had to drop out of community college I was attending. Uh, the video gigs that you guys produce have really helped me pass the time, and I really can't thank you enough for that. You're welcome, man. Dude, thank I hope you. things are getting better, and just whenever you're ready, go back. Exactly. So it's, it's totally cool. And it's yeah. worthwhile to finish it. Yeah. All right, with that said, let's talk about what I've sent you. <gasps> Yay! I was trying to think of something that I could send you guys, given that my comics collection is quite small, uh, and that's when I, what I sent you dawned on me. You see, I live in southern Arizona, about 65 miles from the border of Mexico, and because of all this, all of the best Mexican snack food and candies are available at your average gas station down here. Oh, oh. I like this box. <laughs> <laughs> so I decided to send you guys some in the hopes that you would try them on camera, and I could see people from a completely different part of the country react to things that are fairly commonplace down here. Let's do it! Now also, we're going to smother Ben so that we have more snacks. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> You're not supposed to play with that. I could suffocate. I know. Because I have a child. I know. Um, now, as for what each of these are. The Takis are one thing that I suspect might they might sell nationwide. They feel like Cheetos. Yeah, Takis. I've seen these before. And they are Fuego flavored. Ooh, hot, that means fire in hot Espanol. Hot chili pepper and lime tortilla chips? Are there tortillas? Yes. They're a rolled corn chip uh, covered in chili and lime powder. They aren't too spicy, so if you like a little bit of spice, you should be fine. Okay. Un poquito caliente. Take a tacky. Whoa, they're red! What? They're red! They're like red red? Red red. Oh, that's like danger red. That's fuego. This is dangerous. You have family in Arizona. Have you ever had a taki? I have, I mean, I've seen them, but I have not had a taki. Well, here we go. Synchronized takis. Three, two, one. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. A little bit of My spice My cheeks there. are getting a little red. <laughs> oh, that's good. Mm. Ah! <laughs> Oh, the acid from the lime. Ooh, yeah, there it goes. Oh. That's great. Ooh. Dude, okay, your definition of a little bit of spice. Yeah. That's more than a little. I'm liking it. I don't know if I can eat more than like three or four in a row. No, this is a snack. This is a good movie snack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. man. Like halfway oh. through the movie, you're almost done. And dying. Yeah. Oh, thank you for those. Yeah. Mm. Now, the blue candy bars are a mild chocolate Filled with a layer of jelly and a layer of marshmallow. What? I don't know if I got a more powdery one. I, I think you might have. a really red one. Look at these. They're boo boo loo -boos. Yep. What? boo boo loo -boo. <laughs> I like the little guy. Ho ho! Or bubble lubba? Yeah. Or bubble lubba. I like boo boo loo -boo. boo boo loo -boos. Let's boo boo loo -boo do this. Is this one spicy too? Yes. No! The red on the strawberry it's chill is spicy. It's jelly and marshmallow. All right, we're all going to crack into this boo boo loo here. Take a segment. Whoa! 
Whoa! What is happening? Pull! Pull! Ooh, this oh. looks great. We didn't synchronize. Oh, sorry. I thought you were biting already. No, I didn't I realize smelling. you were smelling. You did the smart thing. Mm. I like it. The jelly's a little medicine-y. It reminds me of the jelly that's in the jelly rings. Oh, yeah. But with a little different flavor. Mm -hmm. I dig I like it. that. I don't know if I need never... more than, like, that one segment. <laughs> I'll finish it. Wow. I don't know. The marshmallow's crazy. I would like the marshmallow more than the jelly. I like mm. the jelly more than the marshmallow. The last ones that say De La Rosa on them. Oh! Mmm. Are they spicy? Yes. Really? You can't have them. They're super spicy. You're not going to want them. You are a liar, mine. You? Yes, I'm, a, I'm totally a liar. Uh, they are marzipan, which is a soft and slightly crumbly peanut flavored sweet. Wait, what? Oh, no. hey, marzipan. Marzipan. That's not what. No, it says marzipan. Well, it Can says marzipan. Oh, I think that's. I think marzipan is Spanish for marzipan. I've only ever had, like, almond marzipan. That's mazapan. <laughs> mazapan. <laughs> oh, so it's, like, more of bread? Mazapan. <laughs> ma ma ah, is two? More two bread? Yeah, more of bread. A day is of. These smell very peanutty. Wow. Mike, wow, this you're is... awesome. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Okay, be careful with this. It's delicate. Okay, I'm gonna go with this. Ooh. It's very crumbly. Okay, there you go. You take a piece. I get my piece. Wow. Here we Whoops. go. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Whoa. Mm -mm. No. <laughs> it crumbles. I don't like that. That's like if a smarty were made out of peanut butter. Yeah. That is exactly what I don't but want. But also very powdery and powdered sugar. That's what I'm saying. Like when you, well, when you know how you sink into a Smarty and it like psh, comes apart. No, Smarty is hard. This is almost like it was just powdered peanut butter sugar that was slowly squeezed into a disc, mm -hmm. but not too hard. You know yeah. what's funny? I really thought when I smelled it, this was going to be super sweet. It was super sweet. Yeah, completely. <laughs> All right. I can see why people dig it. Lastly, are the Pulparindo. This is probably the most Mexican of Mexican candies, and it is mixing... Oh, it's made by mixing salt, chili powder, and tamarind pulp. No. <laughs> Just no. <laughs> All right. I'll let you eat that. I, 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 I'm, my limit is this. I like tamarind. It is slightly sweet, but has a savory chili flavor and is really digestive amongst people. Digestive? Oh, oh. Divisive. Divisive. Oh, I was like, I was like it, it really helps. I was like, it's a digestive. Yeah, Keeps you regular. Um, typically, you like it or you don't. Yeah, well. All right. Ben's going to like it. I'm going to find out. Well, I want some of it. Take I... the part that I touched a lot. I will. <laughs> <laughs> it's like licking your fingers. It, it looks like jerky. Ooh. I like the smell. And go. Opinions. Tiffany is oh. in the don't category. He's right. It's slightly sweet. My the salt salivary glands are having a real problem right now. <laughs> it's just spit oh everywhere. Oh my god! Ow, it hurts. So, oh. I, so I get it. Yep. Ooh, there's the heat though from the chili. I got zero heat. Really? It burns me like right at the end, but only a little bit. Nope. It tastes like a fruit roll-up with salt inside of it. Like you messed up making it. Yeah. That was salt? I thought it was sugar. <laughs> ah, sell it anyway. Sell it anyway. We'll, we'll sell it to the Mexicans. Oh, well, that piece had more heat in it. The bite yeah. I had had no... So it's like throughout. Little pockets. That wasn't bad. I don't know if I would seek Ever that out. Ever have another one. Yeah. Mm. I won't. But it wasn't so, bad. I get it. It's not bad. It's not great. The yeah. second bite was better. It was like, like it. The, like the first bite was, I don't even know how to describe it. And then the second <laughs> bite, I was like, okay. That this is really the other thing. I could do without the heat and just keep the salt. And I think I'd be better with it. I, I could do without some of the salt. My bite had no heat in it. So it was like that. Huh. All right. Well, Mike apologizes if the letter is too long. It's not. It's us eating the snacks that yeah. take a while. Um, but I want to make sure you guys know exactly what you are eating. Thank you for that. Thank you. 
That is, you made excellent descriptions on these. Once again, I want to thank you for all the content you produce. It has really helped me pass the time. Sincerely, Mike. Mike, Thanks, thank Mike. you so much for this amazing gift. Yeah. I gotta stop picking the really red ones. Yeah, what are you doing? Or at least tap it. Give me that. Yeah, it. Oh, you want me to just have some of it? or? You got the rest of it. All right. Oh, damn. All right, let's jump into the next one. Mm. We gotta get more Takis now. Like these, this, yeah. is, this is good. This is a good red. I is did. that a good red? That's yeah. too much red. Did you try that one I had? Yeah, it's pretty strong. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss Takis. We have like those fire Doritos. It's not even close to a Taki. No, Takis punch it up like a whole new level. Okay, this big box is from Robert. Thank you, Robert. In Bakersfield, California. <coughs> awesome. Let's do it. I'm doing that thing that like teachers do. <laughs> yeah. Like... Yeah. And ben are you was... going to stop now? And Ben was doing that thing the students do, where they don't. Nope. Yep. Oh my god, this box is bursting at the seams. I got a letter. No. Greetings, Sal, Tiff, Ben, and Ethan. Oh. It's an exclamation point at the end of it. So, I hope this letter finds you all well. They must know that Ethan is missing. I was thought it was an exclamation point. Yeah. And Ethan, where are you? <laughs> I am a recurring fan and enjoy looking forward to videos each week. All of you have such different views on comics. It's great to see your various reactions to Spider-Clone, Batman Fighting Predators, Daredevil's Adventures, and DC's attempt to undo and redo history. Thank you. I will continue to look forward to all the fun times. I know this box is heavy. That's okay. We appreciate it. Yeah. Well, there is a reason. Last time I sent you my comics purge, uh, this time I am moving your... Uh, this time, since I am moving, you are getting my comics that I just want to get rid of. Oh, good. Thanks. There's right. quite a cornucopia of titles here. I hope you find some enjoyment in these comics, movies, and action figures. <gasps> Hooray! <laughs> I would also like to say hearing Wait, all... Wait, can we take that again for a spit take? <laughs> no, I gotta clean up. I don't have a maid. I have sticky now. Um, I would also like to say hearing all the letters from fans makes me feel good. Seeing such a great community of positivity on YouTube is refreshing. All of you and all of your fans seem like such wonderful people. Keep up with the great work. Best wishes and the stars, Robert. Thank H. you, Robert. Aww, that wonderful. is such a nice letter. I can't speak to letter. us, but I can definitely say our audience is awesome. Yeah, you guys really are. What a nice letter. I like the letters. And the letters on the letters page. Okay, first things up. We have a <laughs> Movie Masters Man of Steel action figure. Oh, sweet. Look Ethan can have this. He loves Man of Steel. Look at him. <laughs> It's, a, actually a, it's this is, a good looking action this is, figure. This is an unexpectedly decent looking Superman action figure because like these were usually like when they made the Man of Steel figures, they were really bad. Oh, these are just, look at all these! I know. I, I, this is my box to open. <laughs> okay, we also have Marvel Legends Ms. Marvel nice. with the Sandman chest for the build a figure. Oh hell yeah! Who uh, else do we need? You want to see that chest? Yeah, you want to show it off. Actually, you need a great assortment here, at least for some of them. You need Green Goblin and uh, Multiverse Spider-Man. Yeah, two that's of them. Uh, Spider Britain. Yep, and uh, Spider-Man in his uh, black suit, uh, Jackal and Shocker. Not the Jackal. Yeah, awesome. Also, just great to have a Kamala figure. We don't have one of these. No. Hey, it's <gasps> Sandman's arm in the Mar Marvel Legends series Spider Britain Mar uh, Spider Man Multiverse. Yay! Oh, that's the twenty ninety nine all. Yeah, that's costume. the alternate. That's the oh, new. That's the yeah. That's cool. It's cool. I mean, not the Britain one. Uh, that Britain one is cool too. It is. Don't cool. get me wrong. Man, why? It, it, this is heavier than Kamala's. Okay. Well, because there's probably more to the arm. Oh no. <laughs> We've got. Build a figure, Spider Man the movie. It's uh, well, I guess it's not even a build a figure. Uh, it's Mary Jane with plank. That's from Spider Man Two. <laughs> Mary Jane with plank. It's just a... yeah, it's just the Spider Man Two. It's a Spider Man movie universe action figures. Yeah, I've never, never heard of these. I never realized how like monochromatic she was or tonal like her whole outfit was. She's very pale. Hey, and we have more Sandman, but a different, different Sandman. Sandman. Hey, hey. Different that's cool. Sandman. We can start our Sandman collection. That's a cool looking figure, even if it's that version of the Sandman. Right? I thought it was Groot for a second. <laughs> I am Groot. I am Sandman. All right, keeping up with the action figures, I think this might be the last action figure. Ooh. It's Batman! Batman and Nightwing. Cool, look at this dual figure pack. This dynamic duo, if you will. Yeah. Uh, let's see, battle shields and fighting sticks abound in this <laughs> set. And Sweet. Batman with his shiving action on his shield. Yeah. Shink. You never know when you need to stab somebody for justice. Right? Well, because it's not a gun. It's cool. Yeah. No, this is fine. <laughs> oh. Nope, I was wrong about the action figures. Hooray! Oh, Stop. I'm saying hooray, you're oh. wrong. 
a DC Universe All Stars Superman. Nice. This is the New 52 Superman costume. It's a cool looking pose on the back. Look at him. Yeah, look at him. That's great. Excellent. Okay, oh, now I'm gonna go this through. This costume looks really familiar. I'm gonna go through some of the movies in here. Ooh. For example, Justice League War. Hey. In a nice metal case. Yeah, very well protected. Kind of like those metal cases. What Me is too. it good for? Watching on the TV. Something that's actually very relevant right now. Unbreakable. Nice. It's a great collection. Good, uh, good movie. Um, The Legend of Zoo. I don't know what that is, but this looks like something I would enjoy. You're find out. So I'll be checking that out. Oh, it's the special edition of Vlad. Because <laughs> I like Vlad. I know. Uh, <laughs> and it doesn't come with two, which is even better. Hey. I know. <laughs> it's got a deleted scene and an all new music video featuring Jackie Chan. Sweet. Uh, Was he in the movie? Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. Nice. Excellent, pick, excellent pick in there. Oh ah. my gosh! Wow, wow. Okay, uh, Justice League: Throne of Atlantis. Hey, Ooh. look at them. Look at them throning. It's very appropriate <laughs> for the time being. Uh, the uh, Justice League: The Flashpoint Paradox. Yep. We yeah, like, we gotta watch that with Ethan. Yeah. Hey, and something close to our hearts. It's Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back. Widescreen, two disc set. There it is. Nice. We gotta check it, make sure it's not signed by Kev, because most of these. <laughs> Snoochie booshies. This is this. I don't think this has ever been open. That's awesome. What else do we have here? It's hey. Hellboy. Cool. It's a nice special edition collection set. Yeah. Wow. The director's cut. Sweet. Oh, that sounds fun. Yeah. Wow. There's more of Hellboy. That's crazy. I hope there's more with kittens. More Samael. Oh, good. He's cool, actually. I like how he's the like undying. All right. Okay. Wow! A collector's edition of, or the Criterion Collection of Seven Ooh. Samurai. That's awesome. Hell yeah. That's incredible. I don't think I own Seven Samurais. I'm really looking forward to checking that out again. Oh man, Ninja Scroll! I've, I've heard, heard of this, but I've never had a chance to watch it, so thank you for sending this. I've I look great to checking it out. Ninja Scroll. Right? Yeah. I, I knew a lot of people who love that. And it's Spider-Man! <laughs> the ultimate villain showdown. It's a collection of episodes from the 90s Spider-Man cartoon show. And the, the 1967 classic episode, The Origins of Spider-Man. Nice. I have that on tape, ripped from like some TV version of it. Well, now you have it on DVD. I can actually watch it. And the last movie no. in here is Bon Voyage, Charlie Brown, and Don't Come Back. My feelings exactly. Hey, what? Get the hell out of here, Charlie Brown. We don't <laughs> want you here. <laughs> That's the movie? Okay. And then in this box. Holy shnikes. All right. I don't think we can go by it every issue, but we can at least showcase oh. some of this. Hey, I had this issue. This is the issue where they reveal that Onslaught's Professor X. Really? Yep. Yeah, Onslaught literally just reaches into Juggernaut's chest, pulls the crystal of Ciderac out of it. Hey! Oh, hey! Superman Doomsday! Nice. With a cool holographic cover. That has it's, it's uh, a lenticular cover. Lenticular? It's. Yeah, you can say holographic. I think that's fair. No, no it's lenticular. It's not. <laughs> hey, this is a giant size number 275 of X-Men. Oh, yeah. Give me giant size number two. <laughs> <laughs> hey, check out this great ad for <laughs> Billy Zane's The Phantom. Yay! I actually really enjoy that movie. I don't know why. <laughs> it's not good. I've seen a few minutes of it. Every time I see a few minutes or a few seconds, I go, Definitely. well, that's the end of that. Definitely a lot of X-Men in here. I think I saw it when it Whoa. first came out. Mm. A lot of Wolverine. Hey, check out this sweet cover for X Men Prime. It's a gorgeous. Cover. Oh, I think I got your books. This is X Men and Wolverine. What? Nice. Oh. I have part of Wolverine's Enemy of the State, which is awesome because it's Wolverine versus Daredevil. So, so far, Sal's picked up like two comics. He's just reading them. Now I got a whole bunch of New Fifty Two Superman. Oh, I have one oh, of those sweet. too. And I got Teen Titans and Teen Titans and Teen Titans. Hey, I found more Teen Here. Titans. The rest of these is this is all Teen Titans. There's also Batman and Robin from Tomasi. So, uh, Get these out of my so way. it looks like you were a big fan of X Men. Oh my God. I'm getting the impression here. And Batman and Robin and Superman. Yes, you read a look. whole lot of DC, man. It's our favorite character, Marrow. Yay! That's not my what? favorite character. Yeah, yours is <sighs> husk. Gross. Husk. Yeah, this one's got cards inside of it. Ooh, check out this anniversary issue of the X Men. The rigid cover. Probably folds out. Mm -hmm. We have like whole runs yes! here, dude. Yes, I know this issue. 
Okay, first of all, this is I a, love Styles' like exuberance at times. This is I great. like that he's just picking up individual things and reading them, as you mentioned. I know. It's the X We have stuff to get through. The X-Men play baseball on this one. What? Gambit versus Magneto and his long flowing locks. Oh, that's Joseph. Uh, it says Magneto. Oh, crap, it does. Maybe that was when he decided to become Magneto, but he's really not Magneto in the Magneto series. Wow! Look at this. It's a Peter Parker, the Spectacular Spider-Man, number 79. Spider-Man versus Doc Ock. Robin Rises Omega? Yeah. Okay. Batman Inc. Whoa. Hey! This looks like Spider. it's from... Spectacular Spider-Man. Rick and Morty. <laughs> This is great. This looks like the Mad Dog Award. Oh, we got a bunch of free comic book days. I hate uh, I Image. Hate... Yeah, I, I uh, yeah it's because it's I Hate Fairyland uh, versus Image. Hostage. <gasps> Tiffany! Hey, it's Mr. Freeze, number one from the New 52. Look at him. And it's Batman Eternal. Oh. As you can see, we got a huge haul. Ooh. This is incredible, dude. Thank you so much for sharing the collection of books you didn't want anymore. Yeah. They will have a home. We are currently in the process of sorting through the long boxes. These will just get re just integrated into it. We got a, a bunch of great books. They are going to uh, be in it. So thank you very much for sending them to us. Doctor Strange is this issue. Yeah, literally, I, I pick up one X-Men book. I open it up. Doctor Strange. And it's like there's samurai on the cover, so it's like, why would Doctor Strange show up in this issue? Ah, but, but it's is. also Doctor Strange shirtless. I know. Oh. It's kind of nice. No, actually it's not. That's Wolverine's arm. Oh, that's just, oh. it's so big that it just took up his entire torso. I thought his shirt got ripped and he was just like, oh, my chest, my manly chest. Yeah. Hey, that's clever. Look at, he's wearing the cloak and then it becomes a trench coat. Yeah, it's Marvel Knights Doctor Strange. Marvel Knights Doctor Strange turned his cloak into a coat. Oh. So cool. This is an incredible haul, man. Thank you so much for sending us all these books, all those toys. And we want to thank everyone from this episode for making this episode so great. Thank you so much for sending all this stuff. It's so incredible to sh see what you find exciting and valuable than sending it to us and having us go like, yeah, this is amazing. And sharing part of you with us. Yeah, right? That's just friggin' awesome. Well, thank you so much for doing it. And of course, if you want to send us a letter or a package yourself, you can always check the description box, grab the PO box address, and then send us one that way. Uh, Tiffany told you all about it earlier. So uh, thank you so much for your letters, your packages, your comics, your action figures. And we'll see you guys next week with another episode of Letters Page. Uh, I'm Sal. I'm Ben. I'm Tiffany. Thanks for watching. I don't know what's happening, but I like it. <laughs> <laughs>